Hey guys, this is a video response to ARCHMC2012. Please actually watch the whole thing through. I'm not going to be like the other people who just like bitch you out. I actually just want to actually, you know, say something about it, about their your video. Emo slash scene kids suck. Yeah, um, truthfully, I don't believe in stereotypes. Um, they don't exist. I I'm sorry guys, it does not exist. Truthfully, I think that stereotypes were created, and I'm sorry I keep doing this with my hair, it was just like blowing wind outside, it was whoosh, so. Truthfully, I do not believe stereotypes exist, I believe that the reason that people believe in them is because of the following. People do not truthfully want to believe that people are different, that there's such thing as different people, so they want order to be in society they want them they want some order to be there so they stereotype these people and put them in groups basically they don't want to actually think that this person's an individual thinker that everybody thinks exactly this thing the whole pictures thing some people just like taking pictures at different angles i guess i do admit on my myspace i have a lot of straightforward pictures like this I do have some of these like weird angle things or the hair thing um it's hair it's hair dude it just grows on my scalp and if i don't like the color i'm gonna dye it and considering the fact that when i get older and i want a nice job i can't have blue hair i can't have pink hair you know they're not going to take me seriously so i'm going to do it while i'm a kid I mean, really it's not that big of a deal and if someone's like creative or something and they want to do colored hair, that's their choice. It doesn't like matter if you have your natural hair, if you have one hair color, if you have two, three, four, five head. It if it if you like it, that's all that matters. The whole music thing also. Where are your sources from? Just just a question, if these are kids at your school, you live, you go to one fucked up school. I like MCR, My Chemical Romance, I do like them. Um, but I don't think that they're hardcore metal. Truthfully, I don't think I know anybody who thinks that. Um, and it's just the genre, I mean, I don't like country music, does that make me emo? The mosh thing? Regular people mosh. Music? I love music, and sometimes it just fills me up and I just get this burst of energy. So I'll mosh. Also, Facebook? Maybe you don't find any email kids or your so called scene kids stereotype thing on Facebook because maybe you're not friends with any. You don't exactly go adding random people on Facebook. Usually, the people on Facebook you know all of them. You do find people your so-called so stereotypes, people with colorful hair, on Facebook. You're probably just not friends with any of them because you stereotype them so much and they don't like the fact that you do. Bisexual thing? This is the one part where I will say, how dare you? And no, you're not the only person I've ever gotten mad at about that. That's the only thing that really pissed me off because I understand where you're coming from with a stereotypicalness. I'm just letting you know it doesn't exist. But to say that everybody with colorful hair or your so-called scene or emo, you know, is bi is just flat out rude. And if you are not against it, then why is it a problem? Maybe a better way to say this is this whole stereotyping that you've created. Maybe these kids who are maybe slightly depressed or different, the reason that there's a cluster of them is because people like you will not accept them. And maybe they're, they're that way you know, because they accept people who are nice. They, they're going to be friends with you if you're nice and you talk to them. You know, you are bisexual or you are gay, a lesbian, whatever. There's a good chance you're going to be afraid that people aren't going to accept you. There is a fear in almost everyone's minds, you know, who is, you know, of some homosexual thing. You know, if you are gay or bi or whatever, there is a fear in your mind the second you feel you might be gay or bi.
you people like that go through this phase where they don't think anyone's going to accept them that their parents are going to hate them if they ever tell them people will go their entire lives without telling their parents you know or their family or their anybody because they're afraid that people are going to hate them people kill themselves over things like if someone likes a girl that's a girl let them let them be happy okay let them be happy maybe they stay in these small groups because no one else will accept them except for these people because they're in the exact same situation or something close to it you never have considered that have you i'm sorry i had to have blown up like this but it really did just make me angry it really did i really would like you to respond to this um because truthfully i've seen some of the response videos and i do kind of look the like maybe the least scenish emo stereotypical thing to you um oh hey we both have blonde hair yay but please actually do respond to this video i know that you're not going to respond to all the 40 billion but really please do respond to this video because i w would like to since we are not going to meet in person i'm not going to give you my information or anything i really would like it if you would respond to this video so we could kind of have like a discussion-ish thing about this because I really am just kind of pissed. Anyway, thank you for watching. Sorry to have blown up. Thank you. Bye.